God, we ask, won't you be our refuge? Won't you be our strength? busy lives we make room for you to rest upon us now as we find our rest in you as we find our rest in you so oh, 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 oh.
the stars to tremble with the light that you bring when you walk into the room every heart starts burning nothing matters more than just to see you at your feet and worship
Jesus. All this is for you, Jesus.
I will sing for you alone have rescued this life. Jesus, you have set me free. You alone took away all sin and disgrace. When you gave your life to ransom me, I will sing. I will sing for you alone. Jesus, you have set me free. You alone took away all sin and disgrace. When you gave your life to ransom me, I am forgiven. At the foot of the cross, I am accepted. By the power of your love, my every stain is washed away. I am forgiven. I will sing, and I will sing. You alone have 
rescue this life. Jesus, you have set me free. You alone took away all sin and disgrace. You gave your life to ransom me. And I am forgiven at the foot of the cross. I am accepted by the power of your love. My every stain is washed away. And I am forgiven. At the foot of the cross, I am by the power of your love. I am saved, is washed away. I am forgiven. Here I stand, here I stand in the light of the glory. Now I live for the one who has called me by name, who is risen and alive in me. Here I stand, here I stand in the light of the glory and grace. Heaven's love and justice be. Now I live for the one. Call me back, who is risen and alive in me. I am forgiven at the foot of the cross. I am accepted by the power of your love. My every sin is washed away. I am forgiven and I am forgiven at the foot of the cross I am accepted by the power of your love my every stain is washed away and I am forgiven I'm embraced, and I'm embraced at the foot of the cross by the love and the mercy you have lavished on us. My every sin is washed away, and I am forgiven.
enemies say Where is your God? Where is your God? My soul will thirst for you My soul will thirst for the living God My soul will thirst for you So we'll thirst for the living water Even when my tears have been my food Even when my enemies ask Where is your God? And I will stand and say Yes, I will stand and say I will thirst for my God Oh God, my hunger for, oh my love for you, would only continue to grow. Create a deeper love for you. for you and me and as the deer pass for the water so my soul pants for you oh my soul thirsts for God with the living water And I still depends for the water So my soul pants for you My soul thirsts for the God The God with the
the bread of yesterday on the water of yesterday so I come to you I come to you fill me afresh fill me afresh oh I cannot live on the bridge of old Would you do it again Would you do it again And all the stories told And all the miracles Would you do it again Do it again And all the Father saw In the days of old
time to sow and the time to reap. Would you do it again? Would you do it again? There's a time to heal, the time to mend.
Holy Spirit fire, burning ever brighter in our souls. Kings and kingdoms holy, hear your people calling. King of kings, we need a miracle. to me. Falling, hear your people calling, 
to you that we'll see amazing things but really would you do it again God it is us who need the revival of the Holy Spirit to arise God burn our hearts and minds God anoint us as we pray in agreement with the heart of our King we need your miracles God that our souls get brighter and brighter burning for what your hearts are really burning for, God. We'll now be going into a time of intercession for America. We'll be declaring the awakenings of the American church. I invite you to come in agreement with my prayer and follow up with your own intercession. Father, we pray that fearing of you and your name will be the only root that churches in America will be growing from. We pray as they acknowledge who truly you are, there will be waves after waves of the repentance flowing from the people of your house, like from all the members, leaders, pastors, and even from the church itself. We pray as they come in the place of repentance, you will purify them and make them to see vividly of the signs that you've been giving to them, God. We pray that their acknowledgement of who you are and their full repentance will make them to be the church who have the ears to listen, the church who have eyes to see, and all those words and acts that are made from the church will be based on the truth of who you are, God. Let them fear you only, God. Let's pray.
come on your church we sing it one more time oh come fill fill us with the fear of the Lord fill us with the fear of the Lord fill us with the fear of the Lord come mark your church come mark your church oh. yes, Father we know your words all the scripture is God breathed and it is also for correction towards righteousness Lord, let them be stored up to be thirsty and hungry for your words and draw the churches in America into your God-breathed scriptures. We pray as they open their Bibles and meditate on it, Holy Spirit would encounter them and give them deeper understanding of who you are. We pray that they would not be the church that would look for only the words that they can be satisfied and be pleasant, but the words that explains your righteousness and justice will be highlighted to them and those words would be like a sword that lord um god make them to be awakened and alerted from their spiritual apathy god god we pray that they would not lord they would not cause their hearts being offensive towards the unexpected perspectives of yours god but let them be found awakened that the more they meditate on, on your words the deeper confirmation they will get and acknowledge your justice and righteousness is, is unnegotiable and unchangeable, God. Let's pray.
God who said let there be light and light was made God, we remember that your word is powerful, so powerful. So God, won't you speak to America? God, we say, let the word of God bring truth. Would you speak to us, God? Would you speak to us? Let the word of God bring life. life. The word of God bring us. Speak to us. Let the word of God bring joy to opening hearts, to opening hearts. Holy say, let the word of God bring truth. Let the word of God bring light. Let the word of God bring joy. opening hearts to softening hearts let the word of God bring truth bring awakening to the people of God the words let of the yours. word of God bring light let the word of God bring joy to opening hearts to softening hearts Oh, let the word, let the word of God bring truth. Let the word of God bring life. Let the word of God bring joy. Your word speaks for the to truth, opening the hearts, and the joy, God. To softening hearts. Oh, God, let your word, let your word. May the word of God bring life. Let the word of God bring joy to opening hearts, to softening hearts. Let the word of God bring truth. Let the word of God bring life. Let the word of God bring joy. Let your word to open their hearts. hearts soften their hearts. Soften and bring them to the place of awakening. Oh. Father, we know as we are getting closer and closer and closer to the end times. You want the churches of America to set apart for the most glorious time as a bride of the Most Holy One. God, we pray that American churches do not come forth to this world or try to negotiate with the world that there would be no mixture in their beings, God. As they fully surrender to you, let their vessel to be purified and cleared out as your beloved, God. We pray that they would be the ones who build their houses on the rock, not on the sand that can be scattered easily by just of one whistle of the wind. As they're setting them apart, God, Lord, be a strong foundation that gets every whole attention of your bride, God. Let's pray.
of the cross itself. Lord, raise him up as a watchman of yours who is bold and courageous enough to take up their trumpet and set it to their mouth to blow God. As it is to the watchman that the sound of the people's awakening is entrusted, we declare more of the strength and the boldness to be given to them, God. Let their trumpet sound be loud and outstanding for whoever needs awakening from the sleep, God. Whether they're inside of the church or outside of the church, God, let them be alarmed to ask for God to reveal His wills and plans for this nation, God. Let's pray.
we stand in the gap. Oh, we stand in the gap. Oh, we stand in the gap. As watchmen on the walls. Oh, we stand in the gap. Oh, we stand in the gap. Oh, we stand in the gap. As watchmen on the walls. Oh, we stand in the gap. Let the watchmen stand in the gap. Let the watchmen take their place. Let the watchmen on the walls. Watchmen on the walls, oh, we stand in the gap, oh, we stand in the gap, oh, we stand in the gap, as watchmen on the walls, oh, we stand, oh, we stand in the gap, oh, we stand in the gap, let them be courageous and bold, let them be strengthened and wise, take their place as watchmen, God. Watchmen on the wall, oh, we stand in the gap, oh, we stand in the gap, oh, we stand in the gap, as watchmen on the wall, oh, we stand in the gap, let them respond oh, to their calling, God. The gap. let them respond oh, to your calling, the Lord, let them remember their destiny on and the calling wall. on their life, God. Oh, Watchmen on the wall. Father, thank you. Your heart is filled with righteousness and justice. We pray the church in America would understand and feel the burning heart of yours and take their calls and places as a watchman. Let them be found as a faithful watchman who build their spirit on the unshakable rock, which is your name, God. We pray as they come and kneel down with the full of repentance. You are the only one whom they will be fearful of, Lord God. Let them be expectant for your second coming at the end of the day as a king, judge, who will separate the good and evil, God. God, you're the holy of holy. We pray the churches in America would set apart as your bride and be a faithful steward of yours, God. Yes, God, we pray all these things in Jesus' name. Amen. And all the Father saw in the days of old, would you do it again? Do it again. And all the stories told, and all the miracles, would you do it again? Do it again. All the Father saw, and all the Father saw, in the days of old, would you do it again? Do it again. And all the stories told. And all the miracles Would you do it again? Would you do it again? You said consecrate yourselves to me And you will see amazing things We need your revival Holy Spirit fire Burning ever brighter in our soul. Kings and kingdoms falling, hear your people calling. King of kings, we need a miracle. There's a time to sow, there's a time to reap. Would you do it again? Time to 
to heal in a time to mend would you do it again do it again oh you said you said consecrate yourselves to me you see amazing things we need your revival Holy Spirit, fire, burning ever brighter in our souls. Kings and kingdoms falling, hear your people calling. King of kings, we need a miracle. Oh, we need, we need your revival. Holy Spirit, fire, burning the brighter in our souls kings and kingdoms calling hear your people calling king of kings we need a miracle and the king is among us his glory surrounds us and his fire is falling as we for us and his love is victorious and the Bible is rising in his veins and the king is among us and his glory surrounds us and his fire is falling as we sing and the savior is for us and his love is victorious Revival is rising in his day. So we need your revival, Holy Spirit fire, burning ever brighter in our souls. Kings and kingdoms falling, hear your people calling. King of kings, we need a Oh, we need, we need your revival, Holy Spirit fire, burning ever brighter in our souls. Kings and kingdoms falling, hear your people calling, King of kings, we need a miracle. Father, we know that you, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob, the God of David, the God who did, of, who did many things, Lord, in the past, we know that that is the same God we believe in today. And God, we ask for a miracle. We ask for a heart of repentance to come upon your people in America. God, we pray for the American church to rise up. Lord, to be awakened to the voice of the Lord, to hear what you have to say. God, we pray repentance. God, we pray awakening. We pray all these things, God, knowing that you are more than capable of doing it, Father. And God, we know that all our prayers are not in vain, that you hear every single prayer, Lord, that went up, that it went into the bowl of intercession, and that you are ready. You are more than ready to just pour out that bowl, Lord to answer our prayers, God. So God, we thank you that you have heard our cry. We ask that you will continue to awaken the American church, oh God, to its destiny, to its calling. Yes, God, we pray all these things, believing that you have heard it, and that you will see it through, God. We trust in you. We trust in your sovereignty. We give you glory, knowing that you have all things in control. We worship your name. It's in Jesus' name we pray, amen. Thank you, everyone, for coming out to our Kingdom First uh, prayer watch for our Wednesday morning. Come out tomorrow night as we'll have another one. Uh, may you have a good rest of the day. Be blessed. Thank you.